Hey, hey, what is going on YouTube? Two sketchy coming at you, and you see this? You see this? Do you see this or not? Let me pause the great gameplay up here. Up here. <laughs> Let me pause the game real quick and explain something to you. That's what I meant to say. <laughs> so, we do have a 3v3, and you know, every time I do a 3v3, I either pull a muscle and or lose my vocal cords the next day. So, I've recovered from the last one, and it's time to do another 3v3. I know I have several amount of them in my inbox, and I, at this point, I was just like, oh, I just I need to get one out before this update comes out tomorrow, which is uh, June, July. I, I always get confused between those two months. The 20th, and... Uh, yeah, you know what? Tomorrow is a huge update, and it's going to break all the replays. Just putting that out there. So if you guys have sent me replays this week, unfortunately, today I'm trying to get as many as I can. Excuse me, I'm disgusting. Um, Done, but... God, why do I keep burping? I'm a pig. Um, The update. That's what I was talking about. Skins. Woohoo! I'm excited. Uh, <laughs> okay, and with that being said... <laughs> There you go, that's the update. Anyways, let's just get right into the game, shall we? We do have an orc player named Kaiser with Commando, Gore Guts, and Beauty the Morkanaut rocking the uh, tractor pull, swing spotter, and stuck in. Nice little, I want to see the tractor pull being utilized really well here. However, his ally is going to be Hell Dragon, and that's the SM player, Imperial Knight Paladin, Venerable Dreadnought, Diomedes, and a Blade of Armor, Destructor Devastation, and a Tarantula Turret. Gotta love these turrets every now and then. And Khalid. H. Kwasim. Oh, buddy. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Kaiser, Helldragon, and Khalid. Okay. All right. All right. I got to remember these names. <laughs> Wraith Knight, Farsi, and Maka. Swapping spiders. And uh, this looks like Rift Blast. Indeed, it is improved. And uh, Crippling Blast. Hmm. I haven't seen that being utilized much either. So, on the other side of the map, we do have two orcs and a Space Marine player. This is Baku. Okay. Back quick. Be quick. Back. As uh, he has <laughs> the commando, Gorgonaut, and Weird Boy Zap Noggin. He does have sabotage. Ooh. If you can rock sabotage, good for you. I, I thought that was a clown face for a second. From up here, it looks like a clown face. Um, If you can rock sabotage, good for you. Because this thing is pretty damn hard to micro. Um, Rocket Barrage, and this is probably Squid Bomb Mine. Yes, indeed it is. And his ally is going to be another orc here. Sunnier. Oh, it's actually Sunnier. Okay, cool. <laughs> Storm Boy's Gore Guts Beauty to Morkanaut. He's rocking the, uh, looks like tons of bobs, healing scrap, and stuck in. Very 1v1 one, one one meta ish here going on. Except the, uh, of course, Beauty to Morkanaut. However, we do have some Spice Breeze. This is a nice little paint scheme here. I really like that matte green esque. Anyways, we do have Solaria, Terminators, and Chaplin Diomedes rocking the tip of the spear coming back from the dead here. Emperor's Influence. And destructor devastation let's just get this game going and uh hurry on get this war on the road here our life I, I really like this this is always so nice they, they just come out of the mouth have you guys ever taken your time and just actually looked at what's going on here like the, the gears cranking and moving and producing units I always enjoyed this all right anyways <laughs> let's just see what these guys are up to as I'm just enthralled by the uh, the visuals of Dawn of War 3. We do have a bone singer up here, Captain his respective point. Gretchen down here, Captain his point. And here, whoever can make it up, to, whoever can make it here first, I think wins. And or whoever can put a range unit up here first with with one melee. If you're mid, your job, I think, is to get your builder unit up here as fast as possible. Put one range, one melee. Because while that one range and one melee will actually help you. Unless you get double teams. So, anyways, we do have a Watt Tower being built here. Other oh, Sunnier. Sunnier is moving his boys up here. And building a thing like this right now is not a good idea because they're just going to be able to come up in here and beat either the Servitor down and or the thing that you've built. Nice cancel there, though. Hell Dragon knows what he's doing, but did not micro at the same time. So, Servitor stopped. He had to cancel and then keep on moving. Let's go check out what's going on down below. We do have a uh, back backing up. <laughs> because Kaiser is utilizing his boys to bully him off as Sunnier is capped mid now. We do have uh, this space marine. What's his name again? It, it was this one. What's his name? Cryptileo. I, I, I don't think I introduced him properly. Crypt. Cryptolite. Kryptonite? I'll call him Kryptonite because he's green. That makes sense. Kryptonite 
is uh, I really like these paint skis, guys. Holy! All right, so we do have an Eldar player moving up way up here. However, does not know there's a servitor in there and is able to decap this point, utilizing fleet of foot from the webway gate, and now finding that there's a servitor in there. Kryptonite does realize this, and Kryptonite does retreat some of the units that he sent down here. So now he has to play defensive. And uh, easily able to get this point for the Eldar player. No fight actually being made here. Point did get lost because of what now? Probably because of this. And or no, it was actually this because we are on Kryptonite's side of the map. Kryptonite is trying to engage here. However, the Kryptonite gets absolutely greeted saying, Hello, eat my grenade, sucker. As the standard comes down in a drop pot right on top of the Dire Avengers back here. Now, both do have shields. One of the drop pot, one just because you're an Eldar player and I hate you. And <laughs> I snuck that in there. And uh, why? Oh, no, we should have kept what? <laughs> There's nowhere for them to go. We should have cut them all. <laughs> Oh, that's unfortunate. Little misrouting there and or pathing wasn't on point. The uh, orc player Sunny Er was able to build himself a listening post, and now utilizing the uh, stealth Gretchen ability. Oh no! Why would you engage on that? Good lord! He he snuck in and then I I guess he fired. And uh, this listening post is gone. A little bit messy. What's going on down below, though? We do have a really strong engagement here from Kaiser. Kaiser greeted by some looters, though. Woo! That would have been his entire army right there. Holy! The amount of DACA coming out of those looters. Good lord. Needing to respect it. <laughs> Kryptonite is up here trying to do whatever he can, but seems to be losing. He needs to position himself a bit better. Putting a Devastator, just kind of walking a Devastator around as your units. Just kind of force yourself in here. Get these Devastators up here so he doesn't have much vision. Just deal damage to not. Doing this one by one kind of stuff is not going to really help you, especially since they are in the vicinity of Webway Gate. Yeah, you got, this is a huge point to get up here. I always win in my games when I'm up here and I utilize this platform. We do have a heavy engagement down below. This tarantula turret was built. I don't know if that's going to do much. Ooh, right on top of the snipers. And uh, where did they go? Hello? <laughs> Wait, hello? Did they just get one shot at? Wait, hello? Oh, this boy is dead. That actually, that was pretty worth. I'm not going to lie. That was actually pretty worth now. He's having to uh, get out of the range of the tarantula turret. Tarantula turret now able to protect... This area, so if Storm Boars and or any boar was able to get on this, I do hear an engagement. This engagement is between Eldar and Dire. He did make it up here, but you need... Now you need your standard. He utilized it earlier. Ah, okay, listen guys. I did suggest doing this, but uh... <laughs> don't do it like with one or two units. <laughs> and or... <laughs> Alright, that looked kind of bad. I did say you gotta get up here. <laughs> but it looked like he did do it. And now he's just covered in <laughs> a bunch of dead troops. Oh, that's a bit unfortunate. But no, you have to get up here with, you know, obviously not <laughs> while there is your enemy right in front of your face. But getting up there first before this happens is what I'm trying to get at, all right? Don't just walk up here thinking, oh, I'm good now, I'm up here. And then there's like an entire Eldar army just able to walk right into your face. So Tarantula Turret is being healed up by a Servitor up here. And uh, looks like down bottom, between the orcs, it's just a standoff. Whoever got this first is now holding on to it because trying to get it back is all about outplaying your guy that's actually mirrored. So the only reason, only, only way that's going to happen is if the other person does make a mistake. Because I did say this earlier in a different video that had a mirror matchup. If one makes a mistake, that's pretty much the only way you are, are able to win a mirror matchup. However, seeing that these looters are moving towards the middle part of the map there might be some 2v1 action here versus uh what's his name hell dragon hell dragon does have a bunch of scouts and snipers and uh devastators diomedes is stepping up here oh this is exactly what i like to see this is what i like to see but it is diomedes that's not something i would like to see if i was this orc player right now he's just going to be able to absolutely ignore everything why aren't these looted by the way Oh, good job. Oh, good job. Now, now, yeah, that's that's exactly it. Woo, buddy. Woo, oh, buddy. Come on, where's the engage on that? 
Y'all gotta. There you go. No, that's not the guy. I want. I want. No. Oh, this is not gonna go well at all. Oh man, the shield of the, the, the heavy cover. This damage is not gonna go through. That is so unfortunate. Even Zap Noggin came in here, but Zap Noggin is for the other player. Woo! Wait, what happened there, buddy? Where did you die? Adventure spam go. Absolutely lost all of them. Who plays Zap Noggin here? Who Zap Noggin is this? Back. My God, that was nasty. Really well, really, really well played here with a good amount of map awareness. Seeing where the uh, the weak side of the map was. And absolutely utilizing Zap Noggin's ability to perfection there. Stepping right up in there and queuing every single die. Let's wait. <laughs> Who is this? Who's the uh, colleague? Kali yeah, if, yeah, of course you're gonna spam more of this. Golly. So now that you have Diomedes helping you, definitely needing to uh, place your troops a bit better. Khalid does have Maka just poking down a decent amount of damage here. No one's really doing anything about this. Why is Diomedes stepping up to a bunch of Dire Avengers? Why these guys can trade for these and Di Diomedes steps up for this. However, looks like back is back. Back indeed. Woo! See, she was focusing the squad their entire time. She's probably going to blow them up here. She does have it in nine seconds. Oh, boy. She's waiting for it to come back. She's just waiting for it to come back. She's going to be able to utilize and blow them up absolutely in one second. Here we go. Ready? Right before she dies. Maybe. Oh, you gotta go. You gotta go over your units. You gotta go over your abilities. This engagement is happening here. We do have a bunch of heavy bolters. It looks like, uh, where is she? All right, she did use it. They did blow up. Kaboom. We missed it, unfortunately. I was trying to cover as much information as I could. These guys died. They went kapoof. And uh, now we're getting two v one up here. We do have crypto versus and back versus uh, Khalid. I guess his name is. As the uh, the orcs and SM player are facing off down here, I like this. I really like this. This is a nice little setup here. All, all you gotta do here is get some knobs, and you you're pretty much good to go. So sunnier. Why are these guys engaging? Where's this engagement at? Oh, okay. I thought there for a second they were like, engaging something a lot heavier. I'm down bottom. Kaiser with the bus this time says, you know what? You spanned a bunch of looters. And now I'm just gonna walk in. We do have some tank busters now this time instead of Ludus. And uh, Kaiser, I think, is able to walk up in here because the majority of this unit was sent up north. Am I right? So back is actually the bottom player. And he's helping all the way up top. But being that he's doing that, he's kind of losing out on the ground down here. Having to retreat some of his tank busters, and tank busters deals no nearly no damage to these boys. You gotta get some looters out here. It's still essentially early games, not even a 10 minute mark yet. Oh, I don't know about these tank busters this early. I don't know about these tank busters this early. It's not gonna do well at all. Losing all of his resources here. These tank busters aren't gonna do jack. They're just gonna die over and over again. My goodness. Back did so well with his zap knocking, but his build order down below is not doing too well at all. Well, Sunnier is rebuilding his army down here and just kind of put him. I like this uh, this little cone we have. Oh, it's actually Sunnier's right here, and then why is Sunnier here and then back is? Why doesn't back back up? He's got commando on, knocking at the door. He can easily step up and utilize his scrap that he came out of his thing to blow everything up to pieces. Oh my God, this commando actually moved up here. I mean, there's a grunt in there, though. How much damage? Woo! Nice, nice, nice. I'd still go in there. At this point, screw it. They can't deal any damage to me. They can't deal any damage to me. Move up in there. I'm trying to see what the hell is going on. Stone boys do die up here, and uh, looks like Sunnier. This is all Sunnier's units. And he has a knob, and a boy, Diomedes. You know Diomedes is going to do a hell of a lot of damage here. And over stand. Where is Hell Dragon in his units? Oh, with some power swords. ASMs are going to move in here. Ooh, buddy, does he have Venerable Leap? He does have Venerable Leap. Looking to engage in here, but oh no, there's so many looters everywhere. Nas, we're sent into this heavy cover, and now these guys are going to have to deal with them. Gotta get these uh, heavy bolters out of here. Look at the amount of DACA that's happening. 
Holy zap Naga is able to step up in here. And these Dark Reapers seem to be in a bit of trouble here. Scrap Blast! Not as strong as it was last time. Diamond seems to be in danger here. Utilizing his passive. Bit of bad micro. Here comes. Oh, he shouldn't have done that just for him. Shouldn't have done that just for him. Good God, that's a lot of shooting. Look at all this. Woo. Oh, yeah, and then teleport your unit right in here. Perfect idea. Yes! Maka, just hello. Welcome to planet Earth. Or whatever planet we're on. Good God. Holy. Micro. What is micro? What even is micro? My goodness. And taking explosive damage now. <laughs> you know the uh, temporal wave doesn't really stop any damage coming in here, right? Hmm. Interesting. But the fact that she utilized the uh, temporal wave inside of this did proc the shield of the shield generator. And now we're here just looking at this thing and we being shot. So it's going to come off any second. Oh, zap! Commando play though. Where the hell did he go? Wait. Wait. Oh, there he is. Oh my god. That save. Oh, MVP Kaiser. That was real. I do see one more being used down here. But that's Bax. Kaiser's Commando right now. God, I love me some Commando. Commando is by far one of my favorite units. He's pretty easily countered, especially if you have some uh, servitors, Gretchens, or whatever that reveal stealth units. But a lot of people forget about that stuff, and it's just the initial damage that actually matters. If you can sneak him in there, that's satisfying enough. Zap Noggin does come in, full back, back trying to help out here. However, we do have more units that are heavy armored, so uh, oh buddy, why would you walk right into that? Oh man. Here comes the Ludus. Ludus do hit uh, Maka down to zero health, and she does get the last chance ability procced up north. We do have woo, whirlwinds harassing some of uh, Khalid's units here. Here comes a Falcon. Falcon is pretty good early on, and uh, it's gonna deal a significant amount of damage to. Yep, look at this. Look at this. Half health quarter health N nearly no health at all and uh, goodbye you can just keep doing that just clean up all the units just account just attack from the side here yep just like that put him put him in a way where diamonds can't get to it just start nailing down look at that damage that's the sexy amount of damage ooh 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 man one one vehicle like this can absolutely demoralize you just keep doing what you're doing Yep, just like that. Look at the space where he's needing to retreat, but the focus is weird. Come on, get the guy with the guy with the guy with the gun. There you go. Even Wolwin's not doing much at this point. Look at this, just cleaning them up one by one. Don't miss focus here. Just keep focusing on that one unit. Get the, all these space marines out of here. I'm just now being able to poke through your health and or the shield. <laughs> that's one. That's one unit. That is one vehicle right now. Cleaning up. An entire space marine army one by one stop putting it in range here there you go poke from the outside somewhere where these melee units cannot get to oh my god still going at it gotta get him back though you can utilize our uh, reinforcements on this don't please don't lose this unit as you're doing so much work with him however we do have sunny oh no this is actually back back is utilizing uh all the uh all the uh the, the siege abilities here Kaiser's commando is in cover. What else do we have going on? Where did that falcon go? Please don't tell me it died. Oh, I had to retreat. All right, good job. Good micro there. Good micro. I thought it just died. Nice little squigs. We do have detected area coming down to be able to find what seems to be commando. Commando is hiding in some heavy cover though, and uh, these heavy bolters are able to find and or see the squigs with bombs. Oh, commando. In heavy cover is being revealed because whatever is in heavy cover cannot stealth because that would just be crazy. Looks like Bax Commando is not being utilized all game. Kaiser's Commando deserves it. a goddamn medal for what he did earlier. Now being stealth that the heavy cover is gone. Totally fine. Knobs are being sent out by Sunnyside. 
Sunny side up, he says, and there goes Maka again with Temporal Wave. Is he going to be able to combo this again? Death Storm from Hell Dragon being able to defend mid. However, there's so much Daka, so much damage, so much loot, so much Zap Noggin. And boys, there's so many more units in the back. This is just wave one. Oh, I don't know about that. We should have been able to put it on this one instead. And now we have uh, an Orc and Army stepping up. Not all of them, but some of them. Here comes the tons of bombs knocking Maka off balance here. To be able to stop Temporal Wave, and this shield is going down one by one. Where are the units at? Why are we just standing around here? There's no engagement. There's no shield. Oh, the shield is back. I'm playing very, very passive here on every side and every lane. Huh. Time for a coffee break then. Alright. Well, now we're back. Coffee break over. Diomedes taking some damage from the tank busters here. Zabnoggin is doing whatever he can. We're still sieging this. I'm surprised it's taken so long. We have so many units. This is going to be gone within a second. One, two, three. Bam, bam, bam. Focus the right thing and you're going to be just fine. Falcons are coming in from Khalid. And here comes the heavy engagement. ASM do jump in on these tank busters. And nobody's focusing on this itself. Nope. Doesn't seem to be the case. Knobs are being forced out of the truck. Two knobs in there. And now we have Fist of Gork. Woo! Nice little venerable leap out of there. Good micro. Holy. Hell Dragon doing a hell of a job there. However, somebody needs to tie up these these units back here. As he is dealing a significant amount of health to the ASM player. That's one. The second one is able to make it out here. And what is going on down here, though? Gore Guts running over what is Back's entire army core. All his production units, all his Y towers, nobody's here, nobody's helping out. This is gonna go to hell. This is all gonna be taken. Nobody's even on the way here, and Back cannot build anything. Let me actually see where his units are. Oh, he's more focused on mid. He's absolutely more focused on mid. He doesn't have any buildings up here. I don't even know if he realizes this. He has a bunch of gruts, but none of them are building anything. He has 1,000, nearly 2,000 requisition. What the hell? Holy. Diomedes is stepping up. Looks like somebody took... What the hell? I was, a, I was like, where? Why, how is it moving around so fast? Looks like he was able to pick it up and take that rocks out of there so he doesn't take a hell of a lot of damage, especially from that meteor falling down. And now... Space Green that was struggling all game, what it seems like, is now pushing up even further. There's no more. There is no more. Even Helldrag is trying to keep him away now. He did this all by himself. Nobody really came up to help him at all. Except earlier with the uh Storm Boys, was it, I think? And or Commando. Oh yeah, back came all the way up top. That's what it was. That's his. That's Dunzo's. So top is winning on this side. However, bottom is sort of winning on this side. Storm Boys did come out for a Sunnier. So Sunnier came down to be able to help him out. And the only thing that back has now is a... Uh, oh, there we go. There he goes. Now he has, he has to build everything way back here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We're knocking on the front door here. Venerable Dreadnought on the field trying to keep them away you know he's going to he's gonna survive some of that damage yeah this is cute billy is pretty damn strong him himself he's pretty damn strong can't even deny that here we do have a uh another commando coming out commando is just gonna step up right underneath him put down the bomb terminators Ooh, i wonder if that was 10 stacks or not because that looked like a large amount where was that at? That was a fire prism shot way back there. It's is there bombs still there? Oh, I think it actually got destroyed by the fire prism shot. Death Storm does come out. Commando, and, and why is this, why is he not paying attention to this venerable dreadnought at all? Why did Zap Naga not teleport? What are somebody answer all my questions? Why is he still alive? Commando still working down bottom here for Kaiser. Kaiser's commando, yo! Holy! Kaiser's commando is an absolute monster. This is gone. This might be. Yeah, okay. I'm not gone, but gonna take a lot of damage. Are those spiders? 
Khalid spiders are here? What are spiders doing here? Why are Khalid spiders all the way down here as he's losing absolutely everything up here? I guess he's trying to help out. Where do the spiders go? Oh, they retreated. Yeah, there's, there's so many like sneaky heroes around. Spiders. Um, Commando. That's it. That's about it. <laughs> that's about it. That's that's a lot. <laughs> but there's several commandos, so it makes it even better. <laughs> Anyways, there's just so much. Oh my god. This is all Sunnies. Yeah, absolutely. Sunny able to hold mid pretty damn well. Every now and then someone helps him, but being able to hold on is pretty damn good. Um, Khalid, you know, he got a little pushed around here early on. Seems like his Falcon was a good pick, but. Not able to utilize it to the best of its ability. And uh, let's actually check out his build order. All we have is a prism cannon and a bunch of dark reapers. Where are these reapers at? Spread out across the map down here. Maka trying to get some vision so the fire prism can shoot. Why is Crypto's... Why is one of Crypto's units white? <laughs> is that a special... That's strange. Why is one of Crypto's units white? The hell? Can't just paint individual units like that. That's that's weird. It must be a bug of some sort. Anyways, let's go check out what else is going on in the map as we are recovering here. This commando's still down here. Holy. He's still going to work. Nobody's stopping him. Boom. Blow this up now. Probably gonna kill these Gretchens. Watch these scratches just melt. Ready? Ready? Oh, oh! Good job, Sketch. Very anticlimactic. Why are we just standing around? What is happening now? Oh my God! What is going on? Why is nobody doing anything? Are they just? We're just waiting for like the biggest standoff ever. It's gonna end so quick. No, nope, we're just gonna help top now, I guess. Well, Maka was found. Why are we just standing around? We're, we have such an advantage mid. We're not gonna re regen these two looters. We have reinforcements on our trucks. Somebody press R. Grab all these units and press R. It's gonna be okay. Did we, wait, did he just wa did he take all of his units out of the wa? Wait, wait, hold on. He took all of his units, then Wa. Now he's nowhere near the Wa. Alright, okay. I mean, wait, what the hell just happened? Shield generator. Wait, what's shield gen? Ah, ah, the siege mode. Okay. Cheese, cheese. That's a lot of cheese. Oh my god. Well, beauty to Mark and Atlas here. So you know what time it is. It's time for everything to absolutely die. We do have both the, uh, the Kryptonite Space Marine player and now Sunnier pushing down top. Top has been struggling all game. They are hitting the weakest side of the map so far. And there go some fire prism shots. And there are filled. Why did he not utilize reinforcements on the trucks? Holy. Good God! That rocket fist absolutely shrek that health. Here comes a drop pod. This shield gen is in danger though. This thing is gonna go. There's no stopping that. There's no stopping this. There's no shield on the shield generator. No action anywhere else. Just whirlwinds over and over again. That shield generator is gone. And uh, just able to push up. Keep pushing up. You do just go. You know, Gorgonaut, Morganaut, whatever. This this not can reinforce units. It is a moving building. Literally a moving building. You can go like this and press R until until you can't press R anymore. But I guess this player doesn't know that. So, he's just going to take a bunch of damage. As we have Kaiser now stepping up in this part. Saying, don't you worry guys. Follow the orcs. I will save you. Ooh, this might be a base race situation here. But, holy. Holy. Here comes the artillery barrage. Ooh, that's a lot of... Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. 
That was disgusting. That was gross. Where'd they go? Holy spam. Good god. Death Storm right on top of this, of course. As they are locked up really well placed and really well timed. There's a Predator Destructor. You know, Predator Destructor deals significant amount of damage to units. I don't think the spider's gonna do well at all. The spider's not even moving, not even trying. Rocks right on top of this. I'm pretty sure this is Kaiser's rocks. And uh, that's a cleanup session. That's cleanup session, boys and girls. What are we doing here? Hello? 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 Why? Why we stop? Why we stop here? Oh god. Oh, nice. Oh, bad. <laughs> oh god. Oh god. Sunnier now pushing up down bottom. Sunnier seems to be the carry of that side of the team. Sunnier was able to hold on to his section mid. Sunnier was able to push up with Kryptonite, is his name? At top. And now Sunnier is pushing down bottom. Sunnier is everywhere. Sunnier is the one that spammed the. Uh... Where are they, guy? Where are they? Where are the tech buses at? Where are the tech buses at? Wait, where are they? I think that's Sunnier's, no? Woo, buddy! Who was a tank buster spammer? Unless they all got wiped. Oh, this is Sunnier. No, wait. Where is Sun? That's Kaiser. What is happening? All oh, this belongs to Kaiser. Kaiser's getting absolutely shreked right now. There's only one orc that's supposed to be doing good. And he says it's me. Kaiser trying to defend. Kaiser is in the blue. And Kaiser getting stunned. And he's just going to be able to walk all over him here. Holy! Trying to utilize the Q ability, but yeah, that's not gonna happen. You hear whirlwind? This whirlwind seems to be in a defensive whirlwind and or an offensive whirlwind. That's a lot of damage coming out there. I hear another volley. Oh my goodness! Oh no! Oh no no no! Is this gonna hit? It looks like it's gonna hit. Oh god! No! They mistimed on this though. Should have did it right as the world one was coming down. Jeez. Oh, some of these plays are driving me absolutely crazy. Golly. You know what? This is a lot better though. This this 3v3, like everybody's helping people. People all over the map. There, that's who's is this? Oh, that's Bax. This entire time I was thinking that Sunyers. Bax is the one that's been spamming this. Of course he is. I'm not surprised. Got his ass kicked. Now he's just spamming one unit. <laughs> did he? Did he step up, up to here? Why is he retreating so hard? He's retreating so hard right now. Sonya is the one that's very active, able to get. Like he's covering majority. He was just in a fight down here, getting absolutely bombed by whirlwinds. Now he's up top with Morganaut. What? Time to engage. Remember, you have your bubble of death on this one. Bubble of death does so much damage. You can just put bubble of death right on top of this uh, the turret. Here comes the engagement. So many dark reapers everywhere. I don't think that's gonna do much. Stormboy, boom, dead. Within a matter of second. That's fire prison back here. If you're wondering what it is, and whirlwinds right on top of everything. This turret should be going down. Gotta just go like this and hit the damn turret so there's no more damage coming in out of that. Woo! That's a big rocket fist. And then pulled right back. Focus the turret. That's all you gotta get through. And now focus about just worry about everything else. Start pushing in here. You know there's a lot more abilities. You can just heal up. Oh my god. There's so many whirlwinds. Holy moly. Commando died. That's Bax Commando. I don't know where Bax Commando died at. Whirlwind right on top of this. I'm guessing. Yep. We're still pushing up. Nobody's really helping him. This is the time to end the game, but nobody's really helping him. Making sure no one's really backdooring this just now. And or yet. Here's Commando for uh, Kaiser. It seems like this is going to be the game here. They are pushing in now. Unless they defend and then counterattack. But uh, I don't know about this. Imperial Knight Solaria is here to meet and greet everybody. Imperial Knight Solaria is taking a decent amount of last skin damage. Imperial Knight Solaria is eating some 
fire prism damage. Why is Imperial Knight Solaria the only one up here? Here comes the standard. Imperial Knight Solaria sitting on 25% health. Why is nobody helping her? Uh, finally. Imperial Knight Solaria taking the dive here. Oh my god. Ooh, ooh. That's, that's for this. That's either for this or right here. One of the two. That's for the core, actually. Going for the core from the three-point line. Look at all these. <laughs> oh my god, the siege. The amount of siege right here. This thing is gone. They can't hold off. Look at this barrage. Oh god, that's disgusting. That is disgusting. GG. Whoo! Wait, it's not GG. They turned off the core. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think they can withhold though. There's no way. There's just too much health left. Too much damage left on the field too. It would have been kind of nice if they were able to come back from that. Nobody was responding to the top assault. Why was that? Why is Eldar only up there? What the heck? Kaiser was focusing. I mean, he did a great job, you know, but nobody really helped Kaiser either. Kaiser did that thing all on his own while up top, uh, Kryptonite was pushing with Sunnier. Back got his ki ass kicked because, you know, um, Kaiser was just playing so damn well, especially with his commando. Golly! That commando play at those knobs that was trying to siege mid, that, that was just crazy. Anyways. Um, GG to whoever this was. <laughs> Thanks for sending me this, and uh, I'll see y'all next time. Uh, capice! Ooh,